Hey, so I didn't mean to like, um, concern you or anything like that, but it seems like we're living in a little bit of a dystopic nightmare, so I was wondering if you could let me trace your face with a stick. Yeah, to just kind of like, soothe ourselves and calm ourselves, try not to give it too much thought. I feel like when you start to give it too much thought, you can start spiraling out into this void of concepts, and it's like, the dangerous part is that you never know, it just doesn't seemingly end a at least from our human perspective, the that which we don't know. So I'm just going to give you a couple of little traces across your brow, across your other brow, across your cheek, across your other cheek, down your nose, and then over the top of your lip, on the bottom of your lip. Um, There's a lot of little floofs. A lot of little floofs. Now I'm just going to give this a good little rub across your collarbone and then across your other collarbone. How does that feel? Yeah, I mean, it's just all a matter of like how you feel about it. It's not supposed to be any big deal even though the neighbor kid is looking at me so stay still I kind of crafted it so that way it's like very simple it's just like a normal stick so I'm going to just give you a little tap on the face like that I'm going to give you soft gentle taps on the face and I want you to tell me on what spot I tapped on okay um, close your eyes for me, please. Yeah, just keep them closed. I'm gonna give you a tap right here. What did I, what, what, what did my stick touch? What did, what did, what did my stick touch? I'll do it again, don't worry. What did my stick touch? Yeah, it was the top of your brow. Okay, let's try it again. What did my stick touch? It was the other top of your brow. Very good. Now, what did my stick touch? What did it touch? Here, I'll do it again. What did my stick touch? Yep. Very, very good. And now, onto your cheek. What did my stick touch? Very good. And on the other side, what did my stick touch? Let's see how I feel with the if I were to start scraping it against my jacket. Hmm. Hmm. Interesting. What's inside of my pocket? What's inside your pocket, sir? Don't put it in your pocket. Don't put it in your pocket, sir. We have a little rope. Okay, stay still. I'm gonna do a little bit of measuring on you. Okay, I'm going to do another little measuring on this side. Your diagonal proportions are actually really on point. No, I wouldn't lie to you. They're really on point. I would not deceive you that way. Okay, I deceived you. They're not on point, but at the end of the day, it's like... It, it, it doesn't quite matter depending on where you slot your perspective of the world. So... If it bothers you, just re-slot your perspective of the world, and then, trust me, the feelings will dissipate. So, here, stay still for me. I'm going to just go right here. Okay, real good. And now top to bottom. Very good. Okay, and now across your forehead. Okay, very good. And now, across the bottom of your face. Very good. Okay, I'm going to just slide this through through, through, put it back in my pocket, put it back in your pocket, sir, and now I want you to just tell me when I feather this through your face, okay, it's gonna just kind of like fall leaf by leaf, once I run out of leaves, I'll toss it away, beep, 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 so, 
just going to feather this through your face as it starts to loose leaf by leaf. I'm getting, I'm getting commentary from the wind. Hello there, yes, would you like to say something? Hello there, yes, would you like to say something? Would, would you like to say, you were skipping around, it was a leaf, a crunkly little leaf that was sort of floating away. Yeah, yeah hello there, yes, would you like to say something? Great commentary, thank you. I'm just going to go right here, brush this across, very good, very good, very good. When did emergency services when did emergency services become like a thing like clearly it was around during the 1800s but when did it become like a loud and obnoxious thing like I'm so sorry that my current death has inconvenienced society <laughs> Uh, here, let's see. I'm going to measure this eye real quick. And now I'm going to measure this eye real quick. I'm going to just put the microphone inside of my mouth until the um, emergency services pass. I think they passed. I'm going to measure this eye. And now I'm going to measure this eye. Very good. And now, oh, excellent. We have some bark. You know what we could do with this bark? Not bite. <laughs> we could just sort of feel out the texture of it. See how it crumbles in our hands. Very nice. Very good. I found another twig. It's like a snake. Stay still for me. I'm going to start tapping your face again, and I want you to tell me where I tap on your face, okay? Okay, super cool. Stay still. I'm gonna tap on your face. Where did I tap? Very good. Where did I tap? Very good. And where did I tap? Very good. And where did I tap? Very good. How about now? Very good. And how about now? Super. Now I'm going to ask you what side is touching your face? This sort of like feathery side or this blunt doll side? Okay. Okay. Close your eyes. Close your eyes for me. And tell me what side touches your face. What side touched your face? Very good. And 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 what side touched your face? Excellent. Ah, nice. I'm going to do it again and I'm going to see if I can beat the other one. It didn't beat the other one. I'm going to do it again and see if I can beat the other one. Yeah, I definitely beat the other one. That was a long shot, too. Let's see if I can beat that one. It's gonna be really hard. Uh, no, I didn't. Okay, let's see if there's another stick. I'm gonna beat it. Maybe not. No, not. Okay. Here, last chance. That was the worst one. Okay. Uh, we should go back in. It's getting cold. Yeah. 
like 78 degrees outside. We need to go back in. I'm going to freeze myself. Okay? Okay, let's go back in.